हैप्पी कि मुझे ये एक्सपीरियंस 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 करने का मौका मिला बिकॉज uh, ये दुनिया और ये वर्ल्ड और ये कहानी का हिस्सा uh, बनने का मुझे वापस मौका नहीं मिलेगा बिकॉज फॉर पीपल लाइक मी जो जिन्होंने ज़्यादा पढ़ाई नहीं की है जो ज़्यादा पढ़ते नहीं है जिनको ज़्यादा हिस्ट्री के बारे में मालूम नहीं है मुझे लगता है कि uh, आप जब फिल्म देखते हो या जब आप लिटरेचर पढ़ते हो आपको बहुत सारी चीज़ों के बारे में पता चलता है हिस्ट्री के बारे में मतलब पता चलता है और ऐसे किरदारों के बारे में सैम मानिक शाह इंदिरा गांधी आई हैव टू रीड अ लॉट अबाउट इंदिरा गांधी एंड आई रियलाइज देर इज सो मच दैट इंडिया हैज गॉन थ्रू एंड दैट इज ओनली बिकॉज ऑफ दिस फिल्म एंड नाउ दिस फिल्म इज बींग मेड एंड अ लॉट ऑफ पीपल यंग जनरेशन उनको पता चलेगा कि क्या क्या हुआ है कैसे कैसे लोगों ने हमारे देश के लिए काम किया है ताकि हम आज यहाँ पर बैठ के ऐसी फिल्म देख सकें uh, विकी का जो करियर ग्राफ है एंड आई हैव टू आस्क दिस क्वेश्चन टू रॉनी एंड मेघना राजी के साथ जो हमने एक चेंज देखा विकी में विच मूव टू उरी दोनों के लिए इजी ओ म्यूज बिकॉज मैम आई एम बींग ऑनेस्ट क्योंकि आप जिस तरीके के डायरेक्टर हैं यू सो क्लियर कि आप अपनी फिल्म में किसको चाहती हैं एंड आई थिंक दैट स्टार्ट राइट फ्रॉम द गेट गो जब आपने पहली बार एक कहानी के बारे में सोचा होता है वेदर इट्स राजी रॉनी फॉर यू द काइंड ऑफ फिल्म दैट यू मेड उरी is he the clay jisko aap mold kar sakte hain i don't think vicky can be molded but he's the clay <laughs> <laughs> you know for me it's very strange because i love him i love him as a person and i love him as an actor and then you put him in the role of sam manik shaw who i completely adulate so a lot of times when i was loving what he was doing i was i was not sure ki am i loving vicky koshal the actor or am i loving what he's doing with sam manik show having said that right from razi uh when there is a character that you know that ye naam aayega aapke dimag mein then you then you don't think left and right it happened with razi it happened with sam because for me i know that he will dive into it and give me more than what i'm expecting he will make it his own and that's exactly what he's done it's there for everybody to see vicky ghar pe aaine hain matlab itne characters jab tum karte ho ke insaan tumhe dekhte hue bhul jata hai ki ye to vicky koshal hai because you've just gotten into that character so much to aaino ki zarurat hai you are like abhi main sam manik show hu nahi yaar ek actor ko aaina to chahiye self obsessed hote hain hum nahi par ye i think 9 mahine jo aise jhuk ke khade the sam ki tarah he had forgotten how to stand straight he had to learn that again ki ab mujhe seedhe khade hona hai bolo na bolo na nahi main agar main apni sam ki journey ke bare mein agar kahu to it strangely started with uh, strangely started with razi uh, hum uh, <laughs> patiala mein shoot kar rahe the razi और दो तीन दिन की छुट्टी थी एंड वी वो होल्ड अप इन होटल जहाँ पहली बार मेघना ने जिक्र किया था कि यू नो मेरी अगली फिल्म दिस इज व्हाट आई एम थिंकिंग अबाउट इट्स बेस्ड ऑन फील्ड मार्शल साहब मानक शो एंड और मैं सुन रहा था कि अच्छा यार ये फिल्म है पर मैंने उनके बारे में किससे सुने थे मुझे ये नहीं पता था वो दिखते कैसे हैं ठीक है तो मैं बात सुनते सुनते ना नीचे मैंने मोबाइल पर गूगल किया कि ये दिखते कैसे फिर मैंने कहा ये तो बहुत हैंडसम है मुझे तो ये रोल नहीं मिलेगा <laughs> तो फिर मैंने मैं फिर सिर्फ सुनता रहा बट कहीं ना कहीं आई थिंक इन द यूनिवर्स तभी एक विश प्लांट हुई थी कि यार कहीं ऐसा एक रोल बिकॉज शी स्पोक सो मच अबाउट दैट रोल एंड दैट लेजेंड लाइक वाह वट अ मैन एंड आई विश इफ आई कुड जस्ट एट सम पॉइंट इन माई करियर गेट एन अपॉर्चुनिटी लाइक दिस एंड इन टू थाउजेंड नाइनटीन मे आई रिमेंबर आई गॉट अ कॉल फ्रॉम मेघना Uh, she lives in Bandra and I was just I happened to be in Bandra aur kahan ho kya kar rahe ho kaha kuch nahi main Bandra mein hu ghar aa jao cool coffee peete maine kaha theek hai main aa raha hu main chala gaya and she mentioned Sam Bahadur again and she spoke again in detail about Sam Bahadur the film the person family army everything and post ho raha hai post ho raha hai correct uh सो so, uh, तो उन्होंने मुझे कहा मैं स्क्रिप्ट देती हूँ तुम पढ़ लो मैंने कहा मुझे स्क्रिप्ट नहीं चाहिए आपने मतलब आप मेरे बारे में सोच रहे हो ये तो मैं 
कई सालों से मैंने यूनिवर्स में छोड़ा हुआ था कि आप सोचो मेरे बारे में मैंने बोला नहीं था कभी पर ये मैं कर रहा हूँ उनका नहीं नहीं तुम स्क्रिप्ट पढ़ लो एंड दैट नाइट आई वॉज फ्लाइंग टू न्यूयॉर्क तो मैंने फ्लाइट में स्क्रिप्ट पढ़ी एंड आई वॉज वेटिंग कि कब ये पंद्रह घंटे की फ्लाइट खत्म हो मैं कॉल करूँ उतरते ही कि प्लीज आप कहीं इधर उधर मत देखना अब मैं कर रहा हूँ मैं आ रहा हूँ और वील स्टार्ट वर्किंग ऑन दिस so uh, that's how this journey happened and in the beginning how she said that you know we've tried to imbibe the spirit of sam manik shaw uh, through the process of the film and i think in every little detail chahe wo uh, conception ho scripting ho uh, jo taiyari ek do saal ki pre production rahi hai uh, phir shooting ho or till the release i think i'm very proud of the fact that uh, humne uh, it's not just a film we have made of course at the end of the day we, the, it's a film we have made but kahin na kahin hame unse bahut kuch seekhne ka mauka mila aur use hamari isi film ki journey mein implement karne ka bhi mauka mila that that discipline was always there that army discipline that you know uh, saying that this film will come on a certain date a year back and then planning accordingly and then coming on that date and sticking to all the goals that she had marked out since a year that you know is tarikh ko ye khatam hoga is tarikh ko ye khatam hoga aur aise hoga so that discipline that got imbibed from learning from such a character that i'm really really uh, proud of that we got we could get to learn so much from field marshal sam manik show ladies generation ko mauka deta hai 12th ke baad aap jaake in the army join kar sakte hain aapka खुद का पर्सनल क्या सोच है क्योंकि आप ऐसे कई सारे रोल निभा चुके हैं सी द थिंग इज दैट आई फील इज एप्ट फॉर अनदर फोरम बिकॉज इट्स अ पॉलिटिकल डिस्कशन सो आई वुड लाइक टू स्टिक इट टू द फिल्म राइट नाउ एंड टू द मैन द लेजेंड दैट वी हैव सैम मानिक शॉ बिकॉज आई वुड लव टू आंसर दिस क्वेश्चन बिकॉज दैट्स माय पर्सनल टेक एंड आई वुड डू दैट व्हेन आई एम हैविंग अ पर्सनल इंटरव्यू विद यू व्हिच इज नॉट रिलेटेड टू सैम मानिक शॉ है ना मेघना हाय विकी लवली टीजर नो डाउट अबाउट इट Uh, Mingna, when you are making a film on a person like Sam Bahadur, uh, you are taking, of course, the anecdotes and in incidents from his real life. When you portray a real life character, where do you draw the line? Are there any challenges you face that where you know that you have to stop and then resume telling the life story? It depends on the life, and it depends on your intention. Uh, what is it that you are trying to do exactly? Um, for a life like Field Marshal Sam Manik Shaw. we have tried to put out everything that we could because his life is so full and large and actually cinematic that i feel that hum aur bhi kar sakte the but i had a duration limit ki itne ghante mein film khatam karni hai otherwise we could have gone on a little longer but we i think the only place where i would even think of a line is when it comes to the dignity of the character that you are portraying that cannot be compromised no matter what incident you are portraying of his life or her life and this this i would think would apply to any real life uh, incident or character that the dignity of the incident or the person that you are talking about cannot be compromised and that comes from the intention of making the film why are you making the film right so yeah thank you um vicky to your right justin you're from indian express hi justin hi Uh, Vicky, two quick questions. Uh, I don't think it has happened before that you have a film coming out on that Friday, and the next week we have Katrina's film also hitting the big screen. <laughs> uh, what are the conversations like back home? What are the conversations like that? Yeah, uh, okay. back home. No, she is excited for my film, and I am excited for her film. And she's not just got one film after my film; she's got one film two weeks before my film also. So I'm sandwiched between her films, which is a great spot to be in. <laughs> also uh, i mean ronnie did mention about the clash and that it doesn't really matter but uh, as an actor how are you looking at that friday because the last time you and ranbi were together the dynamic was very different in sanju uh, what's that friday going to be like for you i think that friday eventually we both are going to hand over our films to the audience so that friday is going to be the audience's uh, you know day more than our day uh, but i think like ronnie very correctly put out today in today's time especially we as an industry should give the option and of of multiple films on the same day to the audience that's how we're going to flourish as an as as an industry uh, we have you know those many weeks in a year but as an industry we can't limit ourselves to making those many films in a year uh, we have to make multiple films and we will have multiple uh, releases on the same day and we got to build an atmosphere where multiple films can work together 
you know, we have that strength in the audience. We have that strength on an exhibitor level. So, uh, so why not? You know, and I think we need to kind of push that envelope also now. Uh, and with today's given scenario, with the excitement that the audience has, I think if they resonate with two films, if both the films are good, there is both the films can work. You know, so so I'm as excited for Animal as anybody else, and uh, so it's it's. I think as long as it's a great day for the audiences, you know, that's that's whom we we work for them, not for each other. Hi, hi, hi. Uh, Mayur here from Beyond Bollywood. Uh, to your right, uh, if you can see me. Uh, yeah. My question is for Meghna and Vicky. If you will give them the answer, it will be very good. Meghna, in my uh, you know limited interaction with uh, army officers, uh, you know, always I get the sense that you know when you speak to them. and you have to talk about uh, you know successful operations uh, the tone is always you know about uh, the, you know they will never talk about individuals but always about uh, the regiment and you know the force as a whole uh, but obviously as a filmmaker and vicky for you as an actor ki jab aap chahe wo sam bahadur ho ya fir vikram batra ho so obviously when a director or a writer writes this film or a very actor acts in this film uh, do you have to also have to ensure that uh, you know the screenplay or the performance doesn't end up Uh, uh, being a one-man army show. I think we have a bit of both in this because we are covering four decades of his life in uniform, and naturally he did not start off as a one-man army show. When he started his military career, he was part of a regiment, and he grew, and he became, and then he went into a commanding role. 